Holy galloping guacamole. <laughs> Did you know this Saturday is both yep. Cinco de Mayo and the Kentucky Derby? That's Woo awesome. Uh, actually happens once every seven years. It is double the fun this weekend and a whole lot going on for the whole family. And when we're talking about fun, we have to have family lifestyle expert Donna Bazo right here with some terrific fun ideas for you and the kids. Nice to have you here. What a fun day. I it's know, right? the fun. I love yeah. when you can double up on the fun, so right? So we have some uh, suggestions that families can get in on this weekend. Yes, yes. So um, sign up for the Cinco de Miler run. Now, mm -hmm. this is Chicago's only five-mile run that's oh, dedicated to okay. Mexican culture, okay. and they'll have plenty of Chips, salsa, and tamales, of course. You can All sign up for way. that at CincoDeMiler.com. Mm -hmm. um, that's happening this Saturday starting at 8.30 in the morning at Montrose Harbor. So okay. why not get the family out and running? Mm -hmm. You can get the National Museum of Mexican Art, too. Sure, it's always a good time to visit that yeah. museum. Yeah. We have plenty of great stories about Mexican culture and um, how it's fit into North American history. Mm. So good place to take the kids, for sure. Okay, speaking of Derby Day, opening weekend at Arlington Racetrack, of course. Right, pony up. It's not only opening day at Arlington Racetrack, but they're going to have what they're calling the biggest derby party Ooh. with hat contests and more. So go ahead and check that out. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> uh, while we're talking about that, take the kids maybe horseback riding. Right. You don't have to go big and fancy. Maybe just look for some horseback riding in town. So Payless Park has a really nice farm called Fitzjoy Farms. They have trail rides and pony rides for the kids. So why not derby it up? Okay. When Donna comes, not only does she talk about activities that we can take our kids to, she brings all <laughs> kinds of stuff that you can keep the little ones busy at home. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so why not find a little combination? Okay. Now, everyone loves the derby hats, right? Yes. That's so Cute. iconic with Derby Day. So I said go ahead and get all kinds of things that they can decorate those derby hats and maybe put in some uh, Cinco de Mayo stuff too this year. Um, and ponchos are big too. Like Put that on, Drew. Put yeah. that on. Yeah, are we, I are know we you doing want this? to. Yes. Here we okay, go. Come on. Come on. All <laughs> easy. Here comes, I let's know. get the poncho on too. Well, here's let's the most at it. Fun. Yeah. <laughs> So, you know, go ahead and you have make those Mexican ponchos to go with okay. those derby oh, hats. Okay. You know, you can cut up any sort of uh, fabric you might have around the house or an old tablecloth or even a pillowcase will do. Somebody oh. snap that picture, please. <laughs> okay. What else, Twice Donna? Yeah. What else is So, I love the idea of a little horse race. My uh. night kids love this and you don't even have to buy it. You can make it. This is oh, an oven you... mitt that you stuff, put eyeballs on, little hula scoop for um, really? hair. Really? And, and you can do it also with swim noodles. Look now, this cool. is easy, too, and something that a lot of people will have around the house and go ahead and challenge those little kids for um, a horse race. How have your cute. own horse. Who needs to go to Arlington Racetrack, right? Okay, yeah. I love it. And you have more stuff over here. Well, you know, it can be simple, but it can also be fun. Go right. ahead and have them plant a rose garden or a oh, flower cool. garden, you know, with the roses for uh, Derby Day, or invite the neighbors over for a Mexican kickball game. Now, this oh. is where you set up an obstacle course, and they have right. to run the ball around all the obstacles, and, you know, maybe you have two teams, the Derbies versus the Cinco's this year, okay. right? Nice. <laughs> I love it, Donna. Great do. idea. Mm -hmm. Okay, and love the outfit. Oh, thank like, you yes. very yes. much, too. Yes. Too. Yes. Thanks. You're such a good sport. <laughs> you are. Thanks, Terrell. By the way, Donna's new book, it's called Fidget Busters. It hits store shelves this fall. Congratulations. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah, it's all about sensory toys that have spiked in popularity for kids. I have so many of those fidgets.